I want to show you how you can disengage the cutting blade on the Bernina L850 serger. And then I'm going to tell you why you probably don't want to do this at any given time and why. So right now, when you are serging, you will notice that your fabric is cut off if it, it extends in front of the blade. So that makes sense. And when people say they don't want to cut something off, I always answer by letting that blade, the part that's going up and down, be your visual guide to just guide the fabric between it. So why in the world would I say that you probably don't wanna disengage that knife? So here's what can happen. If you take the knife out of the way, which by the way is done like right underneath this table and I'm gonna show you where. If you take that out of the equation and it is no longer cutting and your fabric gets a little further off to the side, then it would have allowed if it had cut it off, it actually gets in the way of the upper looper. So if there is fabric in this area while the machine is in motion and that upper looper comes up and gets a hold of the fabric, Fabric, you're talking about a mess that could actually damage the serger. So I'm a fan that if you don't want to have any of that be an issue at all, is leave it up and engage. Let it be that visual little marker that can help you keep your fabric where it is, trim off just a little bit, or trim off the whole amount that you're wanting. Now, right now it is up and cutting as it should be. But if you slide the table off, you will find the lever that will lower it right here on the side. So as I slide it to the left, you'll see that this knife will lower. And once it's out of the way, you can't remember where that cutting width is. And that's why I am a little concerned sometimes when people start to wander their fabric where they shouldn't. And again, getting in the way of that upper looper and the moving parts. So again, I'm a fan that you can lower it, but I have always left it engaged and I have never had any problem. So give yourself that uh, thought process. Um, if you don't wanna cut something, you can definitely take that off. You could put your guide on that comes with this machine and kind of place that in that area so you don't cut it off. But all in all, it's there and can help you stay nice and even as you guide fabric for cutting or not cutting.